our kitchen, we're talking about having a good time. Why am I ask? That's a great question. Always continue to ask things. Be in the pursuit of knowledge. Look, they say curiosity killed the cat, but you know who said that? People that hate cats. Step one, drink. Oh, the wine spat on me. Okay, step one, put cheese in the pot. Do we turn the pot on? What's the pot supposed to be at? Turn the pot on to four. Put your cheese slices into the pot. That's steps one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Next, oh, more cheese, right. So to have a good time, you need three different elements. You need Gouda, which is that you're out to have a good time. Gruyere, because you grew this year, and now your tastes have evolved. Semi-soft Fontina. Just because it's semi-soft doesn't mean you can't Fontina your knees. Hey guys, as I had the Fontina, here's a fun fact. Fondue was popularized in Switzerland in the 1930s. Then it came to America in the 1960s. Fondue was like, yeah, I'm a new thing. Meanwhile, Stu was like, fuck you, dude. I've been around forever. I'm gonna heat it up to seven. Add cornstarch. Toss thoroughly to coat all pieces. Oops, all the cheese is already in the fondue pot. Guess we better just be fine. What? Put cornstarch in? Oh, pew. Also, I think this is turning out terrible. Add some wine to make it fine. Whoops! This is not good for people who are lactose intolerant. Hey, this fondue may be turning out. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Add some lemon, sent from heaven. I'm gonna add some nutmeg. This now smells like eggnog, except sad. Brandy. What is brandy? Brandy is just a manifestation of wine except a wine that's been burnt. We all know somebody that's been burnt. This guy, come on, I touched it with my finger. Now what? How's it going? I mean, it's definitely a pot of disaster. Guys, if you're looking at your fondue and you're like, that's a fond, don't. Just add more cheese. Why? Because cheese solves all your problems. Ooh, all of it? Okay, now. This is a problem with not having a purpose to a kitchen. This is like a weird, sad soup. You know, things look like a disaster in the beginning, but in the end, like the final- It's a disaster. That's what a red flag is. <gasps> oh, yum. <laughs> yummy, yummy. <laughs> oh my God, that looks good. Hey guys, you might have thought this was going to be a disaster, but in the end, <sighs> mm. Hey guys, or what was the sour do? Wait. Mm. Three kitchens is too many kitchens. What was a fondue versus a sour don't? What does that even mean? What are we providing? Look, the point is this. You might think that something looks like a disaster, but give it a chance. Maybe it's not. Just kidding, don't. Don't ignore those red flags. Those red flags you're seeing are real. Get out while you can. It's okay to have fun just so you it's okay to have fun. <laughs> it's... Oh, good. That's also a pun. This doesn't make a video end. A role model. <laughs> when he goes, like animals, 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 moles. Why do you go moles, moles? That means nothing. Why don't you just go, like animals do? Think about that. I hope you enjoyed this video.